hello welcome back to my channel today we're going to talk about easy ways you can earn gems so let's get straight into this first we got infinity castle everyone knows about this but if you don't infinity castle is just a way you can earn you can earn 150 gems per wave and you can get rewards for it so as you can see the rewards on the right you can get star remnants stack cubes perfect stack cubes and you can even get a star when you reach the room 100 so this is like a simple way to earn gems because it's really simple as you can see I don't really play this that much because I'm just gonna wait until I don't know I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I don't know I don't know why I'm not playing it but I'm just gonna try to get to room 100 so I can at least get the star for the next season and then yeah that's a easy that's like one of the easiest ways to get gems especially if you're low level 2 trying to get into the game you can get 150 gems every wave you do you can just go up to as many waves as you as many um rooms as you can and then yeah we're gonna go into the next one we got infinite rounds infinite rounds is probably the best way well the most effective way that can give you gems if not the if not the second best way because when you go into the infinite run you can get gems just by going to from wave 50 you can get like i don't know like around 300 gems and then if you go to your quest say i go on the recent one i can get to wave 50 i'll get um that's over 500 gems and then if i get to wait and then if i stack it with how much i get from the actual wave itself that's like almost a thousand and then you can keep doing those for your infinite quest per day that's over I don't know that's over like 2,000 per day that's if you do it with the quest 2 so that's a, that's a literally the easiest way to get gems another way is by doing challenges um, I wouldn't recommend I wouldn't recommend this because it doesn't give you that much gems and the challenges are random too so I wouldn't recommend doing that but if you wanna like I don't know if you wanna increase your gem count just do it I guess um the other one is tournaments as you can see you can check the rewards here the more damage you get or the more I don't know depending on the, the tournament the what the more higher percent you are the more rewards you're gonna be getting so as you can see I'm level I'm 90 um top 98 percent right now so I'm going to be getting 40 trophies, 3,000 gems, and 25 star remnants. If I went to top 99, I'll be getting a unit and the gems. As you can see, the more the more you're up on the leaderboard, the more gems and more rewards you're getting. So that's not that's not not only a gem farm, but it's also a star remnant farm too, and trophy farm, and unit. So you can just you can get leaderboard units and stuff like that. Um, another way is well, this is a slow way too. You can do raids. It doesn't really give that much gems either. You only get like I don't know. Let me see. It doesn't say I'm oh. If you do the recent ones, you can get like 250 if you complete five of them. It's not a lot, but you know if you want to increase your gem count, do it. If you know what I'm saying. Uh. And that's pretty much it. In this, I forgot to mention how you could also go near the summon section, near the summon part, and there will be a. I think the lady called Casta. I don't know her name. I don't know her name. But there's an event thing where you could do. You can get her quest every day, and you could get extra 500 gems just by doing her quest. And then yeah.